hello everyone this is anirudh today i will show you how you can convert or make a power app to a feature app or a hero app question is what is the usability of a feature app or a hero app we will see everything first i will share my mobile screen and let you know where exactly you will find that feature app okay so here is my mobile power apps i have opened let's say this one any user wanted to make a favorite they will drag at the left side and they will find favorite when they make it it will be under the favorite tag okay now if they wanted to remove from the favorite they can unfavorite anytime it will get, get removed so user can all do all these thing but let's say as an admin you wanted to make a featured app which is uh, your organization wide everyone can see here so there are three but dots here you can see there is a featured app now here by default it will be uh, blank but until and unless a admin going to make it featured none of the app will appear here okay user cannot control this list okay so this is the one of the thing and second thing is like let's say there is a existing featured app and you wanted to make a hero app hero app will always come at the top of the screen so there will be another section will be there called featured app and not all the feature will will appear there only the hero app will appear at the top okay so today i will tell you how you can make a existing app to a feature app or so now we will see few of the things before going to the demo tab i already told you i mean how or where you can see of course as i said there is now powershell command you need to run these are the power app command one is for set and another for clear that you need to take that id app id if you know how to do or how to get that app id you can just put it and run the command there is no problem but if you don't know then this video is for you so same as hero app uh, already told but one of the thing uh, you need to understand that hero app any app you cannot just run and make a hero app first you need to make a feature app and then that can be a hero app in uh, in a tenant that is there will be only one hero app and there can be multiple feature app okay so another thing need not to mention that if any app you have not shared with a particular person though you make a hero app or feature app it is not that they will give get the access of the app okay now these are the two command one for set to hero app and one for clear the hero app so i will show all this demo let's go to that power app now so this is the app i have created power apps admin center in last three videos i already shown three features i have added one new feature here let's discuss about that so user will click or admin will click start button he can find one of the option is called make featured app and hero app click on the next it will ask in which environment the app is there which the admin wanted to select or make a feature app so clicking on environment all the apps will appear 87 apps it is showing now here i have modified if you saw my last video i have put one icon it is a bookmark icon it it will be filled if it is a particular app is a featured app and there is a heart icon it is if it is a this particular app is a hero app then it will be automatically get filled okay let's try on that so click on this button what it is saying that app name feature app no it is not a feature app then this is the command for the feature app so i'll copy this and i will open my parcel i'll take it and i'll run it i run credential so i'll provide my credential and then it will say it is saying okay okay now let's refresh this click on that go here and check it is saying that it is already featured now i will share my mobile screen and check whether it is really done or not okay so this is my mobile screen okay this is my mobile screen and here if i refresh let's say 
I can see there is no changes. Now I'll go here, click on here. There is no changes. I will refresh it and that app will appear. Okay. So that mean now it became a feature app. Now this app, I wanted to make a hero app. But before that, what I wanted to do, I will take another app and make a feature app. Ensure that that app is coming at the below. Okay. So we will target this one and we will again take this one. Then we will run that parcel command again. It's saying OK 200. So now we will see the same app refreshing it. Select the last option, select the environment, and we can see both became featured app. Correct. So now we'll check in our app or mobile, it is already there. But if you see in the home screen, if you drag it, there is nothing coming at the top. Okay. Now we will take one of them is for hero app. So this one. Okay. I'll select this one. Now, if you see, it is understand that uh, the app now detect that it is already a featured app. So it is saying yes. And if you wanted to clear the command get generated, if you want a hero app, then there is one of one of the command came. You just copy it and now paste and run it. I would saying 200 and okay. Now I will go to my app and refresh it. And you can see it is become a featured app. So as I said, so that only one app will appear here. But now user have a choice. If they don't want it to keep that featured app always at the top, they can, I mean, click on that close button and it will disappear from here. Okay. But this is how a admin can do the things. Now, we will revert back. Let's say some of the app, it is not needed as a hero app in the long run. So admin, what admin will do? Now, let's check it. So again, if you see this, this is one of them our hero app. That is the reason it is showing with this icon. Now, I'll click this one. It is saying that clear the hero app command automatically came. So I will copy this. Paste it. Now it is disappear. Let's check with the app. With the mobile app. Now it is already disappeared. Correct. So now if I go here, though I refresh, everything will be there because still it is a featured app. Okay. Now we just wanted to check that one of the map, this one should not be a feature app anymore. So it will take clear feature app command and run it. It will do if you see this. It will be disappeared. So this app i will upload in this app i will upload in github and provide the url you can download and use by yourself you can configure in your tenant you can get all the apps one thing i can tell you that these are the useful features what rarely it used if you are a admin of course you can come in the admin power platform .microsoft.com where you can see the environments here you can see all the environments and also you can see what are the power apps inside that environment who created and modified etc but if microsoft provides something here in the long run saying that make a feature app kind of things it will be very easier for everyone to do the things but yes currently there is no way or no option for that so powershell is the only one but People tend to forget all this command because Power, PowerShell command don't have any uh, UI. So, so here you can find one of the link where if you never 
run any partial command before running the command you need to install some module here is the step by step guidance given in this blog so you can find it not a problem and then you can run that command which actually generated by the app okay so this is pretty much one of so another benefit of the featured app as per microsoft is saying that if you wanted to see all your business app all the app you have created you can find it here correct but sometimes you see that though you have shared with some of the user they cannot find it here so what you need to do you, you can make, make a feature it. app it will automatically appear here so what is the rule of coming appear app here is the person need to access that app at least last seven days then it will automatically appear here uh, or you need to make a feature app so if you make a feature app then it will be appear for everyone that's how they are saying so yeah you can try by yourself but if you are owner it will automatically appear in the screen okay yes so that's all for today let me know if you have any problem to install this app thank you